Hello, everybody. I'm Larry Ridley. You're tuned into the NFL on EA Sports. Two wide receivers will be looking to be number one targets on the field in today's game. It's Smith's Ravens going up against Beckham's Giants. With that, it's time to hook up with our commentators in the booth as we turn it over to Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. Thank you very much, Larry. While the skies may be ominous, there's never a bad day for football. Coming up, we've got what should prove to be a good one between the Baltimore Ravens and the New York Giants. Hello, everybody. Alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gunn. As we get set here, Charles, we talk about wide receivers. You know, Larry mentioned it in the open, but that's a big spot to look at here in this one. I think he identified it perfectly because these guys have such an impact on the game nowadays because they throw the ball more than ever. And whether they're throwing it short, medium, or long, can they snatch it out of the air and create even extra yardage with run after catch? Throwing on first down is Manning. It's hauled in by Shepard. A really nice gain of 25 yards. But that's what you're looking for. Manning again here on second and ten. He's got the hook up to Del Beckham. And he's brought down. Give him 17 yards that time as that'll move the chains. They'll run it now out of the gun. And he is swallowed up right at the line of scrimmage. And they'll lose a yard that time, and that's going to lead to a third down. The secondary here, they're in the down. To throw, it's Manning. He dropped it. Couldn't hang on in the end zone. So no six points incomplete. Here's Josh Brown on fourth down. He was 30 of 32 in field goal tries last season. And Brown able to put it through. And the Giants are off now to a 3-0 lead. So the folks on a delay to give to West. And again, he's going to be stopped up right at the line of scrimmage. No game that time, and it leaves him with third and 11 coming up. And quickly, the starting 11 now for the New York defense. Janoris Jenkins combines excellent coverage ability with supreme confidence in himself. He thinks that no one is going to catch a pass in his area. Calls himself Clemson. Third down, Flacco from the gun. And it's brought in by Pena. And they're going to get this one all the way out across the 45. Incomplete on first down. Now Flint Potter pressure and down he goes. They sack him back at the 36. It's the big offseason signing from Miami. Olivier Vernon in there to sack him for a loss of six. Fake to Allen. Here's Flacco. And he'll be hit as he releases it. And that'll fall incomplete. Tremendous coverage there. Just did not catch the football. Complete the interception. But what do they say all the time? If he had really good hands, he'd be playing offense. Justin Tucker now. He was just 4 of 10 from 50-plus last year. From the right hash, this from 53. And this one is right down Broadway. And that will tie us at 3-3. Three -three. A little bit of a lower trajectory. Throwing on first down is Manning. And this is Shepard on the catch. And he's brought down. They give him 13 yards here. They'll run it now, out of the gun. Looking for an opening, not much there. He'll get it to the 39. They'll get four on second down, but it leaves him with third and still nine to go. Let's get backs out there in the dive. Patrolling the passing lanes. He's got Cruz complete. And he's brought down after a good game. 
The pick at the 24 on the third day. No touchdown scored yet so far. Yeah, none whatsoever. That's running out of steam, and it won't get there. He left it just short. No good. And this game will remain tied here in quarter number two. And that's the risk of the long field goal miss here at this stage of the second quarter. You give up great field position. And that gives them... They look to throw on first and ten with Flacco. And that will be caught. But out of bounds. Out of bounds. Ruled incomplete here. Finally threw an interception, but I thought he played well in their loss in Detroit. He continues to mature as a rookie quarterback, looking more and more like a veteran. And Paxton Lynch got his first start in Denver. Didn't go quite the way he wanted, but at least he's got his feet wet now. Third and just one. It's Flacco. And it's brought in by Pitta. And he is into the end zone for a Baltimore touchdown. Their big tight end, 31 yards. And the Ravens are in for six. And that touchdown gives them a touchdown lead before they attempt the extra point. What a great way to end the half. Yeah, great job to put themselves in front. And now, see on the sideline, special teams defense scrambling, saying we want to preserve this for the final moments of this second quarter. They'll give it to him right up the gun. And he'll be brought down at the 48-yard line. He'll wind up getting 11 on that one. And that'll bring up what looks to be a third and inches. Flacco to throw here on third down. And he finds his man, Kamar Aiken. Give him six yards, and they do convert on third. First and 10, and Flacco looking to throw. And it's grabbed by Crockett Gilmore. And he's going to get this inside the 30. It's a pick up of 14 there. And that'll be good for Baltimore first. They gave up the completion there, but this is what zone defense is counting on. Third and goal. Passing play. Flacco. And that's caught by Aiken. Touchdown, Ravens. Kamar Aiken from four yards out. And the Ravens will extend their lead. And down near the goal line here, they're able to throw it in. And the key word, quick. Quick hitter out of his hands fast, into the receiver's hands even faster. Manning again here on second and ten. And his throw is incomplete. They were trying to get it there to Sterling Shepard. Third down here. They fake the handoff. Now Manning. Pressure gets to him and down he goes. Back at the four-yard line. The safety blitz turns out to be a great call defensively as they sack him for a loss of nine. about Slim and none. Well, Slim just left town on that one. So the offense has it. Six-yard line, first and goal. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Ravens touchdown. Terrence West, a six-yard touchdown run. And the Ravens will add on to their lead. I know the play ends up in the end zone with one person carrying the ball, but how about that big mass of humanity that guided him to that spot? Yeah, they got there, but I love the dive. All a road win in the National Football League. Charles, you never take that for granted, no matter who you're playing, no matter where you're playing. You take it and you run with it. <laughs> and you know you prime the pump all week in your own home facility. No one thinks we can do this. Only people who believe are right here in this room. And then you go on the road, band together, and get it done. Thrust 
for Charles Davis and all our crew. I'm Brandon Gaughan. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For that, we sign off from MetLife Stadium.